Hi everybody, this is Sherry. I am from Succulent Babies on Facebook. And here today I am going to be showing you Aeonium Crusts. And Aeoniums are beautiful when they have mutated and crusts. Now I want to talk to you a little bit about how beautiful this plant is. So come on and join me. As you know, Aeoniums come in all different shapes and sizes. They can just be as natural and as beautiful as can be. A lot of the plants of Aeoniums have some kind of color. This one here is an Aeonium sunburst. This one right here is Aeonium and this is the sunburst as well. But what has happened with this one is that its mutated root element has formed a mutation. And the mutation of the root system has fanned out in a conditional shape of a fan. The, 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 the fan shape itself, and I'm going to do a visual for you, is a fan shape that has come up like this. And then on, on the top of the succulent plant, and this is the root system right here. Root, okay. On top of the plant are the plants, okay. And many of them grow attached to the underside of the plant because of the roots itself. So let's lay this down very gently so that we can look underneath there. So a lot of times you will see all these different routes of of um, of root development. Okay? Like that, like that. And they're attached to the mother plant. Mother plant. So here's this one, that one, and that one. And say there's more than three. This so one, two, three, four, there's four here. Okay, so on top of those, it fans out on top of those, okay, as it does on the bottom part as well, okay, which you can see. So the mutation of the roots itself, now this is a very small pot, and there is no uh, dish um, for water, this is a sealed one. So this plant doesn't really get any kind of watering except lightly and sometimes what I end up doing is I just will take a little spray bottle and I will spray it. I won't give it too much and then I'll come in here uh, sometimes as well too and I'll take out the dead leaves and stuff that have accumulated in between the cracks of them. So that's that one. So that's just to show you that one. So that's basically how that one looks like when it comes down to the root system. Now this one here has been potted up in this box planter and I'm excited to show you this one as well. I also have a big plant of it and I will show you that in another video. But right here as you can see it has actually mutated underneath here as well. So here is just the main plant. Okay, which is right there. Isn't this beautiful? And I have had this now in here. And you can see the um, aerial root of the plant, which is this long aerial root, has now attached itself to the dirt, and that's to help it survive. Okay? And here's another one. Now, I think what I can do is I can... No, I don't want to do it. Yeah? No, I'm not going to do it. I wanted to pull that out for you, but... I think I'm going to wait on that because I don't want to damage it. Um, so I wanted to show you also if I can get as close as I can to it. Okay, so one big Aeonium has planted here, ha has made itself normal, okay, normal root growth. See it under there? So this is all normal root growth. A single and then it subdivided itself when it, when it came down to the um, mutation okay so there again it started off like just a single one like this and it made new ones and then those clusters of flowers grew onto those sides which is here some of it became bigger some of them became smaller. Okay. 
don't worry about it now don't really water this too much because if you do they're going to get so rotten it's not going to be funny you don't want to rot your plants i do have these for sale on my succulent babies facebook if you're interested in purchasing them i can create any kind of miniature garden with them as well and yeah and i think it's very adorable <laughs> Till next time, I'm Sherry. I'm on Facebook, Succulent Babies. I thank you so much for being in my group. If you're liking this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Talk to you later.